guys, so today I'm going to be doing a different type of video. It's not my typical beauty video. Today I just wanted to talk to you guys about how my first day back at school went. Um, today I started my first day of the 10th grade, so this is my second year of high school. I'm no longer a niner or a freshman, so that feels good. Oh, to start off, um, some of you might be wondering what I wore to school today. I wear a uniform normally, so I just changed into something comfortable, you know, a t-shirt. Um, my hair is like deflated from the rest of the day. I wore my hair just naturally down like this, just straight. I didn't want to curl it or anything fancy, I just wanted to be myself. Um, I did a really neutral eye, um, I put on very little face makeup, I just put on some concealer because you know I had to wake up so early for school, I had to hide those tired eyes. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to be natural and myself. This year we have a new principal, so the scheduling of our day is a little bit different. Last year we had a five period day, which meant that we had a full period, a full 75 minutes for our lunch period. But this year we, our school changed to a four period day, which means that our third period is divided, it's longer, and it's divided into three periods among that period, and one of those three will be your lunch. So it's shortened. It was only my first day, so I'm not sure how much I like this new scheduling, but I guess it's going to take a little bit getting used to. So first thing this morning, I got my schedule, and I'm really pleased with it. I feel that all my classes are really balanced between my two semesters, and that's a good thing because last year I experienced that my first semester was easier than my second, and the second semester I was really stressed out. I had so much homework. I didn't have time for anything or any of my friends. It was horrible. Also this year in grade 10, we have two choices of our electives. So both of my electives happen to be in this first semester today. And I'm really pleased with both of them. Um, this year I'm taking cosmetology as one of my electives. And my second elective that I picked was business. I'm really happy with both of them. My cosmetology course seems really interesting. Um, it's about hair care, nail care, skin care and the basics of running a business or a salon. So I'm really excited about that. It sounds like a lot of fun and I'm looking forward to it. My second course is business and I'm really interested in business. I'm really happy with my teacher. He's one of the best teachers in my school. So I'm so excited about that. And I really enjoy the people in my class. It's a great environment and that's one of my favorite courses this year. So besides from the courses that I'm taking this year, I am really excited because I have a few close friends on my lunch. I was a little disappointed but that I was separated from a lot of the friends that I met on my lunch last year. But that's alright because I just get to meet new people this year. So every year, I think it's a great idea to make a goal for yourself for the school year. My goal this year was just to be a little bit more bold, just to step up, to make the first move, to say hi to someone, make a new friend, have close relationships with all my teachers, because I just think that makes for a better school year. And today I feel like I really stepped up and I acted in a way that really embraced my goal. Now that this is my second year in high school, this is not a new school to me anymore, so I took it upon myself to help the new grade nines at the school if they were lost or if they needed help with anything, if they had any problems finding where they needed to go. And it really felt good because last year I knew I was in their same position and I would have loved it if someone was there to help me. And there were people to help me. There were many people of the older grades that did help me and I really appreci appreciated it. So I was really excited to see all the friends that I didn't see over the summer and it was just great to reconnect with them. We all hugged each other. It was such a great moment. I had a really great first year in high school and I'm really looking forward to this year and the next two years of high school for me. But my advice to you is to really get involved with the school. Really make a relationship with your teachers, make lots of friends, get involved with school clubs and activities and sports teams. Don't be afraid to try out just because it's your first year in high school or maybe it's not your first year in high school. Just get involved. That will make your year. I know me last year, I was so scared to try out for the dance team. I thought that everyone was going to be so much older and so much better than me, more experienced, and I thought that I was never going to make it. But I did make it, and I was so glad that I tried out. Being on the dance team last year was like one of the best parts of my year. It really contributed to a great year, and I met a lot of new people there, not just the people in my grade that were in my classes, but it was a lot of older kids that were really nice to me and the teachers were great. It was just, it felt so good to be part of the school. 
So do it. Be bold. Try out for a team, a club, anything. You will not regret it. If you don't make it, who cares? It doesn't matter. You tried. And you can try again next year. It was worth it. Hmm. I don't know. I don't really know what else to say about my day. Um, I had a great day overall. I'm really looking forward to the rest of the school year, how things will change. If anything changes, um, I will be sure to keep you guys updated. Um, comment below and tell me what your goal for this year is. Tell me how your first day went. If you already went back to school, you can leave it as a comment below, a video response. That would be great. I just love reading the comments and hearing how your first day went. Oh, and one more thing. Don't forget to subscribe. I am excited. Excited. Excited.